Good afternoon. Please take your seats. The ceremony will begin in 10 minutes.
Ladies and gentlemen, I am Dr. Mitty Kochi, Associate Dean for Undergraduate Affairs for the College of Engineering, and it is my sincere pleasure to welcome you to the 56th UIC College of Engineering commencement. Today's music is provided by the UIC Wind Ensemble under the direction of Nicholas Carlson. This commencement brings together members of the University of Illinois Chicago family, students, college administration, faculty, staff, relatives, alumni, and friends. Before we begin today's ceremony to assure that everyone enjoys this meaningful event, would you please take a moment now to turn off or mute any cell phones and electronic devices that may detract from the ceremony? Thank you. At this time, I present to you the administration of the University of Illinois Chicago and the faculty of the College of Engineering. Everyone, please rise as you are able and join us in singing the national anthem, led by Grace Seaman. Please remove your hats, and the words can be found in the back of your program. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we Broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight. O'er the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming, and the rockets red gleam, the bombs bursting in air, gave proof through the night that our flag was still.
Please be seated. In the spirit of building a better future and healing, I would like to take a few moments to acknowledge that the UIC resides on the traditional territories of the three fire peoples, the Ojibwe, Odawa, and Badawami. This area was also a site for trade, gathering, and healing for more than a dozen other native tribes. What's more, the state of Illinois is currently home to more than 75,000 tribal members, and the Chicago area is home to one of the largest and most diverse urban native communities in the US. We recognize that the indigenous peoples are the traditional stewards of the land that we now occupy, living here long before Chicago was a city and still thriving here today. As we work together today on these territories and in the year ahead, we must remember our responsibility, especially as a land grant and Asian American and Native American Pacific Islander serving institution, a Hispanic serving institution, a minority serving institution, to find ways to right the historic wrongs of colonization and state violence and to build bridges with and support indigenous community struggles for self-determination and sovereignty. Now, to formally open the College of Engineering's commencement ceremony, I present the Dean of the College of Engineering, Dr. Peter Nelson. It is my pleasure to extend a warm welcome to our graduates, their parents, families, and friends on this joyous occasion, the culmination of the graduates' years of hard work and families' years of support and sacrifice. Many of today's graduates not only spent thousands of hours on their studies, but they balanced sometimes precariously employment, perhaps raising a family, along with being a student. The families of our graduates are also a critical part of the effort we celebrate today. Parents, spouses, and family members provided a wide array of support crucial to the success of our graduates. An obvious component of the support is financial support, but often even more important is the intangible support, the moral support, the encouragement offered, and understanding about the long hours spent in the classroom and lab. I now invite all of our graduates to please rise if you are able and turn around to face your spouses, parents, families, and friends and express your gratitude for that support. Please be seated. There is a special group in this graduating class that I would like to recognize. Will the graduates or are active or veterans of our armed forces please rise if you are able? These students are disciplined, committed, and know the meaning of performing their duty and serving their country. Now they have met the requirements for graduation from the College of Engineering. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in extending our congratulations and our sincere gratitude to all of our military students for their service. <laughs> Graduates, you can feel confident that you have received an excellent education here at UIC. I hope that the excellence of our faculty, the high quality of their research that keeps them at the forefront of their engineering fields, and our college-wide commitment to teaching excellence have served you well and prepared you not just for technical proficiency, but for a lifetime of learning, a curiosity about new challenges, a delight in creative innovation, and a commitment to be part of the solution for which engineers are so uniquely equipped. I also hope that some of you will accept the challenge of serving in the public sector where critical judgments about issues of science and engineering are made. I encourage you to give back and make the world around you a better place. 
We hope that you will remain in the UIC College of Engineering family through active participation in our alumni association and continuing engagement with our students and professors. I wish each of you success and enjoyment in your chosen profession, engagement with the world outside your job, and the happiness of a well-lived, meaningful life. Congratulations. I'm now pleased to introduce several distinguished individuals joining us today. Please stand, if you are able, as I introduce you. UIC Acting Provost, Dr. Karen Colley. UIC Acting Dean of the Graduate College, Dr. Jonathan Art. And the heads or representatives of, of our six academic departments in the College of Engineering. Biomedical Engineering, Dr. Tom Royston. Chemical Engineering, Dr. Vikas Berry. Civil Materials and Environmental Engineering, Dr. Koros Mohamedian. Computer Science, Dr. Robert Sloan. Representing Electrical and Computer Engineering, Dr. James Kosmak. and Mechanical and Industrial Engineering, Dr. Hushang Garabi. I would now like to introduce UIC Acting Provost, Dr. Karen Colley. Dr. Colley has served as UIC's Acting Provost and Vice Chancellor for Academic Affairs since June 2022, her second time serving in this capacity. She has also served as the Dean of the Graduate College since 2012. She is a professor of biochemistry and molecular genetic, genetics in the College of Medicine. Dr. Colley also serves as the director of the Portal to Biomedical Research Careers Postdoctoral Research Education Program, the Pipeline to an Inclusive Faculty Program, and the editor-in-chief for the journal Glycobiology. Since joining UIC in 1991, she has been recognized as a university scholar, co-founded and led the first umbrella graduate program at UIC, and served as the Associate Director of the Medical Scientist Training Program. Dr. Colley received her bachelor's degree in chemistry from Duke University and her PhD in biochemistry from Washington University, St. Louis, and later continued her training in cell and molecular biology as an NIH-funded postdoctoral fellow at UCLA. Please welcome Dr. Karen Colley. Thank you, Dean Nelson. Good afternoon, everyone. I am so happy to be with you all today to celebrate this incredible graduating class. Seated before all of us today is a graduating class unlike any that has come before them. And today is their long-awaited and much-deserved celebration of all they've accomplished and the new adventures that lie before them. So, Please join me in a warm round of applause for our graduates. They absolutely deserve it. And thanks to everyone here today to mark this special occasion for this graduating class. I would like to extend a special thank you and warm welcome to our speaker today, Rafiq Mohammadi a proud and respected alumnus of, who will provide our keynote address, and as well as our student speaker and recipient of the Bell Honor Award, Dia Patel. Also to the families, friends, loved ones of the graduates this afternoon, thank you not only for being here today to celebrate with your students, but also and more importantly for being an invaluable source of support for these students during their time here. I think all the people graduating today would agree that they couldn't have done it without you. So thank you again very much. And another immense thank you to the many professors, mentors, advisors, and staff in the College of Engineering and at UIC whose support for and belief in these students has helped them navigate, triumph over, and most importantly, learn from the challenges they've faced these last few years. 
Let's thank your professors and mentors. Hey, graduates, you made it. Yay! <laughs> Alongside your friends, classmates, research partners, and collaborators, you have achieved something truly remarkable, and you should be exceptionally proud. While all students face obstacles during their studies, you've not only endured and overcome the disruptions and losses that occurred in your lives and our communities during the pandemic, but you have also demanded and continue to fight for a more just and inclusive future for generations that will come after you. And all of you have left your own unique mark on UIC and the world. Your legacy at UIC is one of resilience, a commitment to the pursuit of knowledge and radical care for each other and the, your communities. UIC has become a greater institution because of the contributions you've made these last few years. On behalf of everyone here today, thank you for letting us be part of your academic journey and your success. So no matter where life may lead you next, know that you are forever part of UIC's community and you're always welcome here. More than that, please continue to come back, visit, share your successes with us, volunteer, contribute, and help us inspire and support the students who will follow you. So who are the 2023 graduating class of the College of Engineering? Graduating this year are more than 500 undergraduate students, over 200 master's students, and more than 30 doctoral students. All of these students are exceptional and have promising futures as leaders, innovators, scholars, creators, and shapers of a better tomorrow. In most, almost no time, each of your lives will change forever. You will soon walk across the stage and become alumni of the University of Illinois, Chicago. This new chapter in your life may bring a mix of emotions as you create your own path in this world. Undoubtedly, you are excited, but I wouldn't be also surprised if you weren't a little nervous, and that makes a lot of sense. But unlike your first days on campus, you will now go into the world equipped with new tools to succeed. The wisdom, lessons learned, skills honed, and networks of support that you have built in your time at, in the College of Engineering and at UIC. These will be the keys to your success and the success of those around you. I want to encourage you to seize the opportunities before you and to keep growing and learning. Do not shy away from challenges and taking those unexpected paths, for you never know where they might lead. I joined UIC as an assistant professor 32 years ago, and I would never have imagined the path I took or where I am today. I have had many mentors along the way who encouraged me, provided opportunities for me, and challenged me. But one of my greatest mentors and my biggest supporters was my father who would stop me in my tracks every time I would complain about an obstacle or a challenge I was facing and say, but look at how much you are learning. First, I thought that was pretty darn annoying, but after a while, I realized he was actually right. So in this spirit, I ask you not to shy away from taking risks and facing challenges. View them as learning experiences and keep moving forward. Each of you has so much to give, and you never know where your path will take you. But I am convinced that all of you will make this world a better place. And so finally, to the class of 2023, congratulations once more. We are tremendously proud of each and every one of you. It is now my honor to present this year's commencement speaker, Mr. Rafiq Mohammadi. Rafiq Mohammadi is a highly accomplished computer scientist and engineer who has almost 40 years of experience in the software industry. He received his BS in computer science from UIC in 1983 and returned to the university to receive his MS in computer science in 1995. Rafiq also earned his Master of Business degree from Northwestern University's Kellogg Graduate School of Management. 
Rafiq currently serves on the Board of Advisors for the College of Engineering and remains active within the Chicago and UIC communities. Driven by his entrepreneurial spirit and passion for building successful software companies, Rafiq has had a long and rich career. He started his path working as a software engineer with Telesystems and Teradyne, moving on to become the president of the MH Group, where he helped the company create innovative business applications for personal computers. Rafiq then co-founded iManage to offer internet-facing document management systems. Under his engineering and product leadership, the company went public in 1999 and grew to $50 million of revenue in less than four years. iManage today has more than 900 employees, including many UIC alumni. The company continues to thrive and innovate. Today, Rafiq is focused on machine learning and as a serial entrepreneur continues to look for new opportunities. He is also actively involved with NGOs that focus on early childhood development and primary education. Please join me in welcoming our commencement speaker, Mr. Rafiq Mohammadi. Good afternoon. The first order of business today, as regards my little conversation with you, is to solemnly swear that this speech, this little talk, has not been generated by ChatGPT. <laughs> Congratulations, everyone. This is your big day, and you've worked very hard to get here. My first graduation from UIC, and I had many graduations, but the first one from UIC was an important milestone. Today, I'd like to share with you my journey, and most importantly, my gratitude at the opportunities that I've been given. I arrived in Chicago from Pakistan just after Christmas 1978 at age 18. I chose UIC because it had a good engineering school and tuition, you might find it hard to believe, and tuition was $600 a quarter for an unlimited number of hours. <laughs> Seems like a minor miracle given the cost today. As a first generation immigrant with no immediate family in the US, finding an authentic version of the American dream has been a very difficult process. The challenges have been both social and economic. I found love, happiness, and eventually a measure of economic success in this great city of ours. My wife, Michelle, has been an indispensable partner in navigating life. And we have raised a wonderful daughter that is graduating this month in New York. Through it all, UIC has been a beacon of hope and inspiration. UIC from the very start, for me, was a joy. Guided by brilliant teachers, I began to discover the beauty of experiential learning and slowly develop that elusive visceral feel for specific areas that leads to both questions as well as innovation. The first quarter in 1979, I took four courses and was totally impressed by the fact that every one of my teachers had a PhD. One of my earliest programming language courses at UIC was an assembly language class, never mind if you don't get that reference, it was an assembly language class using a DAC mini computer, which has been extinct now for three decades. Our teacher, Professor Moore, decided that the entire quarter would be one single project, building a functional basic programming language interpreter. I was able to accomplish what seemed impossible the first day of class because my teacher set high expectations provided expert help, and above all, gave us the confidence, the self-confidence to tackle a difficult task. 
In my sophomore year, I was informed by my advisor that without the necessary electives, I would not be able to graduate. Just about the only thing available that quarter was French history, which for a Gujarati immigrant from Pakistan is about several light years away. Reluctantly, I stepped into a lecture hall and encountered one of the most formidable teachers I've ever met. In memoriam, Professor Stanley Mellon was rightfully described by his colleagues as one of the most stimulating lecturers in the history department. Professor Mellon helped us read Democracy in America by Alexis de Tocqueville and delivered a series of brilliant lectures on the deep, deep roots of anti-Semitism in the old world. Through his lectures, I began to gradually understand the power of the ideas that has shaped our civilization. The lectures delivered in early 90s on the evolution of democracy, due process, and academic freedom still resonate and provoke deeper introspection. I did not quite realize at that time, but something extraordinary was happening. My teachers, my brilliant, kind teachers, were helping me develop a lifelong passion. Hunger for knowledge because of its sheer beauty rather than the need to pass an exam or because it was immediately required for some material gain. That hunger will stay with you forever. The great anxieties and the exam anxieties do fade away, but the knowledge stays with you always. Post-graduation, I chose a different path. After a brief stint as an engineer at a large company, I co-founded a software company, MH Group, in 1983. We had a startup capital of less than $10,000, half of which was spent on buying a single IBM PC with two floppy drives. I still remember pulling in all-nighters, coding in Pascal, and packaging boxes for customer delivery at the end of the day. After years of hard work and minimal compensation, we built a very useful application to transfer information from dedicated word processing systems to personal computers, the newly emergent personal computers. By the fifth year of our journey, our customers included a substantial number of the Fortune 500 companies and a lot of prestigious law firms. Twelve years later, when dedicated word processing systems became extinct, I used the earnings from the first startup and co-founded another software company, iManage, with several UIC alumni. It was a rocky road, again. We decided to build a highly reliable document management system that could scale to millions and millions of documents. After two years of hard work, we were able to build a viable product. And then came the hard, significant, difficult challenges. Successful IPO in 1999, a complete technology market crash soon after, being acquired, a great re recession starting in 2008, becoming independent again, and then being hit by a 100-year pandemic, and now back to high inflation again. Through it all, there were huge tectonic shifts in the underlying technology, and we stayed relevant. We stayed relevant by constantly innovating and delivering outstanding customer service. iManage today is a very successful cloud software provider, and this year we will probably exceed 1,000 employees with a global customer base. The current CEO, CTO, and chief software architect are all UIC graduates. How cool is that? The company considers continuous learning, customer satisfaction, diversity, and community participation as core corporate values. I'm proud of these guys. 
For over three decades, I've been recruiting UIC graduates, and I consider UIC students to be more mature than many of their counterparts. I attribute this to the diversity of our campus and the deep appreciation of the privilege of a good education, which helps us value and respect opportunities. You are in great company. There is research available today, significantly well-established research that diverse teams do extremely well. UIC gave me the ability to start knowledge-based businesses which scales far easier. And America, again, and America, gave me the confidence that my failures would be a rite of passage rather than a badge of shame. Don't be afraid to fail. It's very normal. Warren Buffett recently attributed his phenomenal success over 58 years to a handful of good decisions. He said, one every five years. And I think that is rarer than blue moons. You'll get your opportunity. I'm confident of that. You'll get your opportunity. However, preparation, commitment, and passion are vital to make it a success. Good values and strong support from your friends and family will enable you to survive the lean years, and there's bound to be lean years. I finally retired last year. And I look back across the many decades, and as I look back across the many decades, I'm reminded of the distinguished mathematician G.H. Hardy describing Ramanujan as the greatest romantic experience of his life. Professor Mellon was my most interesting educational experience. His ideas would lead to a more meaningful life based on the seeds he planted I would ultimately come to believe that the health of our society can be judged by how well we protect our most vulnerable minorities and the continuing need to evolve to a more perfect union. Let me emphasize the continuing need to evolve to a more perfect union. Currently, the airwaves are dominated by news of high inflation and impending recession and dysfunctional politics. Just as a simple reminder, the prime rate was 21%, an unimaginable 21% when I was a junior. This cycle too shall pass. The best way, really the best way to cure dysfunctional politics is to get involved. Your participation will improve public discourse and lead to a better balance between the here and the future. Congratulations again, and I wish you constant learning, healthy relationships, uplifting experiences, and a prosperous future. Thank you very much. Thank you, Rafiq, for those poignant remarks. Great teachers are the heart of a great university. The University of Illinois at Chicago annually recognizes and honors its outstanding faculty. Recipients of the Civil Circle Award are selected by our students who honor those who have taught them with distinction. I will now call upon Diya Patel, the student representative of the graduating class of 2023, to present the UIC Civil Circle Award for Excellence in Teaching. Each year, the students of UIC honor those who have taught us with distinction in the many forms of our university. I am honored to present the Silver Circle Award to Professor John Comperda from the Department of Mechanical and Industrial Engineering and Professor Mark Hollenbeck from the Department of Computer Science. Please come forward to accept your award.
The Harold A. Simon Award for Excellence in Teaching is presented by the College of Engineering to a faculty member who exemplifies dedication, distinguished service, and excellence in teaching that were the hallmarks of the late Dr. Simon's career. The award was established in 1985 to honor Dr. Harold Simon, a professor of mechanical engineering who served the college during its early years. This year's recipient is Professor Gonzalo Bello from the Department of Computer Science. Professor Bello, will you please come forward? And to present the award, I call upon Ms. Sue Brady, doctor, daughter of the late Harold A. Simon. It's my honor to be here today and to share the stage with so many accomplished people. As Harold Simon's daughter, I grew up appreciating the value of education. It took me longer, however, to appreciate the value of an excellent teacher. It is so meaningful to our family that the UIC has kept this award alive in my father's memory for the last 38 years. He truly was an excellent teacher. He taught mechanical engineering, a topic I know nothing about. But I do recall the time he had us collect hel helicopter seeds from the maple tree in our front yard so that he could stand on his desk at class the next day to drop those seeds to teach his students about rotation, lift force, stable vortices, and the like. Well, perhaps I didn't, and I don't, understand the concepts he was teaching, but it was a fun moment as a kid to realize my dad was so cool. Just a few words about Dr. Bello. I went to the source to learn about him, Google, I ended up on RateMyProfessor.com. I know, I know, it's perhaps not the most reliable site, and it's mostly filled with negative comments, but the reviews I read about Dr. Bello were glowing. Here are just a few quotes. The angel himself, the best professor in the whole department and the whole university. This man needs a good raise. OMG, this is literally the best professor at UIC. He is the best. And with that, I can say I am so proud to give this year's Harold A. Simon Excellence in Teaching Award to Dr. Gonzalo Bello. UIC recognizes graduates who have distinguished themselves in various ways during their academic careers. As I describe various academic honors in the college, I ask that those so recognized please stand if you are able and remain standing until all academic honors have been called. And audience, please hold your applause until the end. The Bell Honor Award has been given since 1951 to the undergraduate engineering student with the highest grade point average of each graduating class. We have 28 graduates who meet the requirements for the Bell Honor Award upon completion of this spring semester. We would like to recognize the Bell Honor recipients who are in attendance today. Will the Bell Honor Award recipients please rise if you are able. <laughs> Ada Kapanu is the International Honor Society of Electrical and Computer Engineers. Selection is based upon scholarship, character, volunteer service, and distinguished accomplishments. The society recognizes graduating members with embroidered scarlet stoles. Will the members of Ada Kappa Nu please rise if you are able. Please hold your applause. <laughs> Pi Ta Sigma is the National Honor Society for Mechanical Engineers. Selection is based upon scholarship, leadership, and service. Members are presented with engraved society pins which they are wearing today. Will the graduating members of Pi Tau Sigma please stand if you are able. Tave to Pi is the National Engineering Honor Society to which students are selected on the basis of outstanding scholastic achievement, exemplary character, and community service. Graduating members of Tau Beta Pi are entitled to wear white collars embroidered with their society's emblem. Will the members of Tau Beta Pi please stand if you are able. 
Alpha Eta Mu Beta, the National Biomedical Engineering Honor Society, elects its members based upon distinguished scholarship, leadership, and exemplary character. Will the members of Alpha Eta Mu Beta please stand if you are able? <laughs> UIC Honors College membership entitles graduates to wear gold stoles. Will the engineering graduates who are members of the Honors College please stand if you are able? University Honors recognizes the college's graduating seniors with highest academic achievements. Summa cum laude, 3.9 or above GPA with gold cords. Magna cum laude, 3.7 to 3.89 GPA with silver cords. And cum laude, 3.5 to 3.74 GPA, bronze cords. Will the students who are receiving University Honors please stand now. All students who have been recognized with, with these honors, please stand and let's join in acknowledging the academic accomplishments of these outstanding students. Please be seated. We, we now come to the part of the program where a student has the opportunity to address the graduates. This year, the student representative is Dia Patel, who has earned her bachelor's in mechanical engineering. Good afternoon to our faculty, families, and friends. And hello, class of 2023. I am truly grateful to be given the opportunity to be this year's student speaker. Let's first give a big round of applause to everyone that has supported us in reaching this milestone today. Well, we did it. We really did it. Week after week, month after month, year after year, we put in an immeasurable amount of hard work, lots of determination, skipped a couple of 8 a.m. classes, Okay, maybe way more than a couple, and most significantly demonstrated that we are all capable of success. The first time I was in this arena was on convocation day for newly admitted students back in 2019. I sat here in these very same chairs with the UIC campus map in my hand as one of hundreds of other new students. Those that were sitting around me were excited to begin their college journeys a diverse group of perspectives from all walks of life with one thing in common, the desire to turn their dreams into reality. Their enthusiasm paired with the vibrant welcome of the speakers on stage encouraged me to feel excited myself, but in all honesty, I was scared. I was entering university with, without declaring a major, with no career plan, and barely any self-confidence. So what happened between Convocation Day and today? Well, as I progressed through my first year, taking all those math, physics, and general education courses, I found myself surrounded by engineering students. They were hoping to one day design the next space shuttle, the next revolutionary biomedical device, the next autonomous vehicle, and quite literally, the next future. I began to look at the technology around me and wonder, how does that work? Looking to answer this question, I filed a major declaration form in the midst of the pandemic. Fast forward a few weeks and I took my first engineering class. I got my midterm, ex exa I got my midterm exam score back, which was a 63%. <laughs> I remember showing my score to my mom, a UIC engineering alumni, in tears because if I couldn't understand statics in CME 201, I definitely was not qualified to become an engineer. Uh, each day, I attended virtual lectures, and I felt out of place. Everyone else seemed to be understanding the concepts except for me. For the duration of that class, I remember being tempted by the change of major form at least three times, <laughs> as I'm sure all of us have felt at one point or another on our educational paths. Sometimes 
it was difficult to see the light at the end of the tunnel, but what we all did by being here today at this ceremony was prove that little voice in our heads wrong. Instead of quitting, we persevered through. And so thank you, UIC, for teaching us that we are not defined by our failures, but by our ability to rise above them. UIC Engineering has provided us all with something that will stay with us for the rest of our careers. And no, it is not our ability to finish an entire assignment that we started an hour before the deadline. <laughs> UIC has given us a community. When we struggled, many of our professors opened their office doors to help. The Counseling Center lent us a listening ear. The TAs responded to our frantic 2 a.m. emails within a few minutes. Our peers, some of them now our closest friends, were with us through our low points and our successes. As you all know, there is nothing that brings students together like the post-exam discussion that takes place seconds after we turn in that test. This delicate support system that we built and maintained will not be left behind. It is a network that we will always have access to no matter which direction our lives take us. Our journeys over the last few years have been filled with joy, frustration, laughter, tears, a good amount of imposter syndrome, and a whole lot of strength. As we are gathered here to say one final goodbye to the, and thank you to the institution that has rigorously shaped us into engineers, we must acknowledge that this is not the end. We are the new generation of inventors, designers, researchers, and maybe even professors. It is our responsibility to create a world that is better than the one that we are in today. Each and every one of us is going to change lives, and we must strive to ensure that our work as engineers improves the quality of life for those impacted. And to those that feel afraid of what may come next as they leave UIC, I would like to assure you that you are not alone. There is at least one other person that feels that same way, me. <laughs> New responsibilities and challenges are in store, and that can invoke a lot of fear. But by standing here today, dressed in cap and gown, we are all walking proof that we are capable of anything that will be thrown our way. Each time we look fear in the eye and stare it down, our resilience will grow, and the actions we take when faced with adversity will reveal our character. The upcoming years have many changes, events, and milestones in store. And I'm confident all of us will persevere and give our best through it all, just like we did here at UIC. Congratulations, class of 2023. I wish us all the very best as we venture out and change the world. Thank you. And to my parents, Daniela. <laughs> Thank you, Dia. We now come to the high point of our commencement, the presentation and recognition of our new graduates. We will begin with our doctoral candidates who will be presented by Jonathan Art, Acting Dean of the Graduate College. We begin with our doctoral candidates who will be, pre uh, excuse me, <clears throat> Dr. O'Kennedy, please rise and remain standing. <laughs> Provost Colley, upon the recommendation of the faculty and by the vote of the Senate, I have the honor to present these doctoral candidates for the corresponding degrees for which they stand. Upon the recommendations and by the authority of the Board of Trustees, I confer upon each of you the degrees for which you have been presented and admit you to all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities of those degrees. Congratulations. Please be seated. We will now recognize our Master of Science graduates who will be presented by Dean Art. Will the Master of Science candidates please rise and remain standing.
Provost Colley, upon the recommendation of the faculty and by vote of the Senate, I have the honor to present these master's candidates for the corresponding degrees for which they stand. Upon these recommendations and by the authority of the Board of Trustees, I confer upon each of you the degrees for which you have been presented and admit you to all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities of those degrees. Congratulations, all. Now, please be seated. We will now recognize our Master of Energy Engineering and Master of Engineering graduates who will be presented by Dean Nelson. Master of Energy Engineering and Master of Engineering candidates, please rise and remain standing. Provost Colley, upon the recommendation of the faculty and by the vote of the Senate, I have the honor to present these master's candidates for the corresponding degrees for which they stand. Upon these recommendations, by the authority of the Board of Trustees, I confer upon each of you the degrees for which you have been presented and admit you to all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities of those degrees. Congratulations. Please be seated. We will now recognize our bachelor's graduates who will be presented by Dean Nelson. Provost Colley, upon the recommendation of the faculty and by the vote of the Senate, I have the honor to present these bachelor's candidates for the corresponding degrees for which they stand. Upon these recommendations, and by the authority of the Board of Trustees, I confer upon each of you the degrees for which you have been presented, and admit you to all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities of those degrees. Congratulations. Please be seated. We now invite the graduates to approach the stage to be recognized individually, beginning with the doctoral students. Please refrain from taking photographs of graduates on the platform. Professional photographers will be taking pictures of every graduate. After the commencement, there'll be plenty of time and opportunities for you to take your own personal photographs. We now invite the doctoral graduates to approach the stage. Doctoral graduates will be hooded by their faculty advisor as they cross the stage. Congratulating the students on stage will be Provost Colley, Dean Art, Dean Nelson, and honored guests. After you have crossed the stage, please return to your seat and remain seated for the remainder of the ceremony. Ahmad Jalal Nafak. Debujoti Saha.
Chen Ji Zhang. Ahmad Ali Jiradet. Grace E. Brown. <laughs> Daniel Edward Christensen. Hamed Dolivan. Omid Memorast. Abhijit Haribayu Fakatkar. <laughs> Muhammad Habib Mahdi. Milad Bashir Zadeh. Farid Manu Cherfar. Malika Saleh Habadi. <laughs> Devanch Sani. Arthur James Nishimoto. <laughs> Diego Pesashi Ihara Centurion. David Allen Randolph. Okay. 
Wang Fei Wang. David Lay. <laughs> Rezvan Nazampur. Moeen Mohammadi. Mina Valizade. Mohammed Mushtaba Ati. Maryam Pishkar. We now invite the master's graduates to approach the stage to be recognized individually. Congratulating the students on stage will be Provost Cawley, Dean Art, Dean Nelson, and honored guests. After you have crossed the stage, please return to your seats and remain seated for the remainder of the ceremony. Ryan Buffel. Gautam Prakash. Aditi Ravi Wadwa. Elizabeth M. Zeller. Adam Al Rubaya. Frederick Cabouye. Sadek Almaz. Catherine Garcia. Constantine G. Vessel. Jaya Sai Chandra Nataki. 
Abdullah Amr. Nikhil Naik Satish. Davud Ahangari. Naeem Remat. Kristen T. Moore. Vidhi Deepakbhai Patel. Kirna Jatendra Kumar Shah. Gisela Claudia Castillo. Jocelyn Escobar. Alejandro Lara. Mohammed Asman Salim. Neil Subod Mehta. Zena Basam El Habal. Khaled Hussein Al Katawi. Arun R. Madhavan. Karam Shamma. Drumil Baveshpai Padia. Parth Prashant Tamboli. Flavio Depis Ambos. Valeria Beauty Kando. Gurbir Singh Danoa. Bo Xuan Yang. Hong Wei Mao. Jesus Escobar. Ismael Salas. George Daniel Lukachu. Mercedes Dolores de Beza Rodriguez. Caitlin Ann Cozio. Isaac Salvador the Fourth. Aditya Balagopal Nayar. Nihar Shailesh Joshi. Rajit Subin Pujakareja. Sarang S. Devani. Kumar Chandrasekhar. Diana Elizabeth Roy. Priyanka Raghavendra. Karthik Poser. Akash Adesh Jain. Mayur Chandrakant Mole. Vedant N. Maheshwari. Anjani Shruti Doradla. Shivali Singh. Jason James D'Souza. Samrudi S. Kalsekar. Kunal Shah. Harsh Jethwani. Miles Patrick Shamo. Yash Jayanth Kukarev. Thiruvankaram Siva Prakasam Radhakrishnan. Priyanka Vivek Patil. Veronica Grosso. Giuseppe Cerudo. Davida Porello. Davide Giacomini. 
Simone Zanella. Alberto Carbonari. Giuseppe Straquadagno. Sai Nirmal Morampudi. Suman Donapudi. Manoj Kumar Aluri. Muhammad Adim Sheikh. Shiva Praveen Danga. Pranavi Ali. Giri Madhav Poturi. Sai Anish Garapati. Shashanka Mali Subramanya Srivalati. Raghuram Chepuri. Yashvant Reddy Tadisina. Sai Sampath Vene Maruvada. Rahul Sai Samaneni. Indra Sai Kiran Baluru. Nihal Chandra. Aditya Ramesh Ogale. Abhijit Chintakunda. Jadhajit Roy. Mohammed Abrar Tarek. Anish Prabhu. Aditya Ranganathan. Andres Javier Tapia. Sean Sebi Coloner. Ajitai Spanso. Shobana Ayasami. Monisha Sidananda Sampat. Vinayak Banwarilal Cabra. Richa Shailesh Bajbal. Jason Dominic Pereira. Venkita Lakshmi Monica Bachu. Asif Iqbal Ghazi. Ajay Marampali. Neil Chavla. Matthew John Zeminski. Saksham Ayush. Theophilus Tete Okansi. Dipanshu Raguwanshi. Gagan Green. Ankit Chandrasekhar Kaushik. Kyle M. Chandetka. Gautam Kushwa. Ayush Gupta. Devansh Naimish Patel. Krusha Vijay Kumar Patel. Rajat Kumar. Nikita Thakkar. Kuldeep Singh. Manmohan Dobra. Vikram Abhishek Sa. Pradhan Bangalore Suresh. Sharanya Manohar. Prajwal Pandit Cook. 
Ashwarya Ganesh. Rishabh Lamba. Praveen Raj Velaswamy. Akshat Wagadre. Priya Manish Sharma. Nitesh Dewan. Thank you. And Vesh Koganti. Sharath Suresh Bargo. Jeet Parash Mehta. Sweta Jayakumar. Madhumita Rajarajan. Drishika Day. Supriya Chowdhury. Lokesh Rup Kumar. Tejas Dhananjay Rajapadye. Harsh Mishra. Amrit Raj Vardhan. E. Mai Jha. Tanme Sandeep Kelker. Saloni Kalra. Aditya Chowdhury. Sahil Lamba. Mir Piyush Shah. Aditya Subhash Rao. Aditya Devendra Kantale. Dwanit Sharma. Abhijit Chandra Kumar. Venkatesh Gopalakrishnan. Aikya Banerjee. Rishabh Goel. Vaibhav Bhargava. Samihan Vivek Nandedkar. Amay Cosby. Chinmay Badnerkar. Fahad Safaraz Amin. Shravan Patabi. Vivek Kumar Varma Nadimpali. Kushal Reddy Palvai. Venkata Likit Ayagari. Ananta Rohan Paran Kusham. John V. Reddy Ega. Sai Lahari Senku. Shreya Raj Kati. Karan Deepu Jogi. Aditya Ravindran Nair. Venkata Sai Akil Nididavolu. Shanmuka Sai Sagar Teja Pati. Kirthana Gayatri Ananda. Vincenzo Petrolo. Ting Yu Lin. Sharon Matthew Sasi. Sandaria Babu. Sandesh Pampatiwar. Yash Saxena. Romil Ketan Ray. Anupama Asuri Prabhu Venkatasan. Krishnan Chalakarai Sivaraman. Santana Gopalan Krishnamurti. Dina Bolat. Ruba Almajan. Kusai Akram Burhan. Amru Musa Qutub. 
Massimiliano Mastro Giorgio. Paolo Cananero. Giulio Barletta. Rebecca Di Siena. Shashan Rai. Ryan Sanchez. Jong Wan Moon. George S. Cruz Peralta Jr. Mohammed Thayer Fazi Abu Mwala. Yasser M. Salame. Akshay Berwani. Tejas Sriram. Shlok Pramesh Kumar Soni. Ude Kiran Kusapati. Shrikant Nila Kandan. Ayush Rajendra Palrecha. Anish Deepak Jangle. Rushikesh Milind Sule. Arvind Narayanan. Sarit Hemang Shah. Sai Siddharth Bakacherla. Ayush Deepak Chobi. Rutaraj Ratskar. Mohammed El Khaliba Afan. Pushpank Manohar Atawadkar. Tiffany Lejeune Pickett. Kamal K. Harris. Orman Oshoria Ormiaik. Augustine Idose Obese. Cater Minnes. Birutawit Zaleke. Mantasar Albayati. Catherine M. Anderson. Kapil Kumar Shukla. Sikai Lee. Taeyoe Zhang. Finally, we invite the bachelor's graduates to approach the stage and be recognized individually. Congratulating the students on stage will be Provost Kali, Dean Nelson, and honored guests. After you have crossed the stage, please return to your seat and remain seated for the duration of the ceremony. Chandana Volati. Tamana E. Dore. Sara M. Kishta. Karen Rebus. Rana Jarala Abbott. Rebecca Ramirez. 
Janet Kiroz Esparza. Syed Benam Mahmoud Shamsadin. Ryan Hunjin Park. Sebastian Soto Lara. Duin Mai. Angela Beatrice Warren Lechauko. Stephen C. Ha. Nara M. Michelle Alice Chavez. Alexandra S. Borobiova. Joseph Caleb Mustafa. Liliana Melissa Landy. Nina Laliwala. Jacqueline Escutia. Rianne Frausto. Utia Alton Gerald. Orla M. Joy. Siley Gajanan Dawe. Samuel Meyer Winters. Giselle Martinez. Amina Sayeda Nazamuddin. Destiny Joy Crookshank. Nisha Suresh. Ahmed Mohammed Hassan. Neil Nimesh Soni. Tanvi S. Shingade. Terrence Lynn. Nicole J. Sherrick. Deep T. Singh. Jenna Sakai Yusuf. Joshua S. Pangalinen. Anushe Amar. Julie Victoria Gawenda. Veza Wakaz. Jennifer Kayla Meza. Lana S. Kadra. Stuti S. Patel. Jamie Ray Ronda Cortero. Nura Katanani. Valeria Hernandez. Mary Ashley Tenedor. Hari Shankar Manoj Benita. Huthefa Bin Khan. Besher A. Jabri. Renee Elizabeth Saraki. Malik Ashraf Nusayarat. Yasin Abdul Ghani. Yusha Kalestum. Abdullah Eid Rashid Saeed Al Hajeri. Rebecca Ann Ellington. Alexander George Boskov. Vihar Jayanthibai Trada. Andres Alexis Rodriguez Castro. Jesse Allen Anderson. Tan Ho Nyat Nguyen. Ayush Ketan Patel. Abadar Al Kurdi. Abdul Rahman Abdallah Hamida. Ramiro C. Roman. 
Jordan Edward Flanagan. Mohammed Zahir Alam. Tristan A. Swastigi. Blerta Usaini. Isaac Cirilla. Abigail Hartzell. Mohammed N. Mostafa. Jerome C. Reginald. Kareem A. Mohammed. Sufi Yusuf Khan. Sergio Del Rio. Cooper Christian Ross. Masa Bokari. Thomas M. Wen. Sidney Nilesh Patel. Salma Tamer Ahmed Mohammed T. Khalifa. Ola Shubomi Solomon. Draga Otsokolich. Naomi Elizabeth Rosa. Hasia Najmin Isa. Matthew Valet. Lauren M. Landwehr. Anna Marta Patak. Namrata Patel. Salawa Ibrahim Ahmed Bukafel Aliasi. David Pulido. Jocelyn Aylin Ortega. Pauletta Mariana Ioannidis. Ruben Lopez. Miriam A. Alani. Krishdeep Singh. Azan Ammon. Clayton Inslee. Abdella Al Farouk. Carter Philip Aldridge. Alexander Edward Komenik Avalos. Jeremy Joseph Yakes. Eduardo Barbosa. Marcos Ivan Barone. Kyle Stephen Ahart. Carlos A. Bravo. Darshan Alpesh Shaw. Ishan Ravi Vadakuparako. Alondra Angelique De Lourdes Santos. Nikki Shrujo Patel. Jesus Rene Avila. Michael John Severin. Alan Joel Quintana. Alexis Joe Escobar. Grant J. Jarrett. Matthew Andrew Gesenica. Carolina Derula. Juliana Marie Dinka. Michael S. Yonker. Darish U. Enanua. Sahara Elizabeth Witt. Zarina Roselle Reyes Bautista. Angela James. Sitlali Sandoval. Michelle Lemus Alvarez. Pao Mateo Chacon. 
Sergio Gonzalez Lozano. Alex Daniel Sanchez. Zach Weitzel. Abraham Jaramillo. Michael A. Duenas. Daniel L. Suzuki. Hildardo Luna. Stephanie Elise Santos. Aiden J. Kobayashi. Edward L. Mercator. Omer Ahmed Subani. Mohammed Abdullah. Michael Kobeck. Camille Zalewski. Erica Cizek. Natalia Tilka. Alisher Dardanbaya. Daniel Nunez Jr. Ellie Tehi Lawson. Suleiman Haider. Darius Lankowitz. Alexander Manuelos. Karen Moreno. Royland Castillo Jr. Christian V. Correa. Rama Aljagasi. Aisha Umer. Darshan Patel. Nikita Mashenko. Rayan Siddiqui. Not Nayal Abebe. Huzeba Nadim. Imad Mohammed Abdullah. Lisbeth Morales. Manasvi Narayanan. Harris Bujic. Michael Tyler Carnawell. Roman Budnarchu. Mohanad A. Saleh. Hadi Adnan Usmani. Sa Javed. Justin Miguel Scofield. Brian's Boyna. Abbas M. Madani. Gurcharan Singh Panasar. Dat Tan Wen. Alexander Byrez. Patrick Oshtovsky. Ha Un Kim. Farboud Amiri. Latif R. Bain. Fahad Ula Khan. Alan M. Thomas. Sneha Vandana Vijaya Kumar. Makayla J. Garner. Mohammed Miraj. Divya Kumar R. Patel. Mario Ocampo. Marcin Seleski. Abdul Sami Mohammed.
Snigda Ghosh Dastidar. Zara Farin. Sara Ather. Noor Abdel Halim. Bianca Isabel Atienza. Jonathan Mejia. Megan Samuel Herrera. Bhubni Bhavesh Shah. Tanuj Rakesh Duve. Safiya Mustafa. Harshal Patel. Vamsi Reddy Ayapanini. Aksa Arif. George Liv Yiratos. Win Kong Win. John M. Lee. Amrit Paul Singh Rajput. Muad Karana. Hannah Puachova. Jobad Uribe. Sagi Fierro. Hector David Sedeno Indriago. Krishna Chaitanya Bhavana. Christian Lee Bingman. Madhava Sai Yamike. Hamza M. Ali. Kevin Sabbath. Abhinob E. Baki. Andrew M. Mina. Xiao Chen. Quan Lap Yuan. Ethan Robert Wheeler. Ryan Jacob Crafton. Matthew K. Olawinski. Michael P. Maxinski. Carl Andrew Flood. George Voivodich. Hassan Body. Alexander Tomasz Takachik. Osmar Hernandez. Zan K. Amer. Joseph Ninos Tamriz. Zachary John D. Levenko. Tristan J. Maltizo. Gabriel Caralde Nickdow. Meg A. Patel. Mohammed J. Hashma. Michael Andrew Gibson. Rathal Gupta. Christian Sanchez Jimenez. Mohammed L. Mbao. Mohammed A. Kamal. Amarendra Primartika. Robert Sean Malone. Young Sung Ong. Kizer Sharif. Conrado Manzano. Carol Chislakowski. Michael D. Kulikowski. Gustavo Saucedo Jr. Sharon Tome. Zahra Halafi. Sai Samitha Chandu. Lizbeth Gutierrez. 
Bilal A. Hashem. Harry Tan. Joshua Realibit. Manya Singh. Amatala Testimony Elugelo. Demeladi Shudipe. Michael Jude Squires. Benjamin S. Hernandez. Tamara Eileen Rice. Adam Richard Beigel. Nishant Mahendrasan M. Chadasama. Cole Pearson. James J. Kim. Haza Ahmed Mohammed Al Hosseini. Rashid Saeed Laes Rashid El Ketbi. Sultan Mohammed Ne Talib Al Shakiri. Ryan G. Power. Khan Dui Nguyen. Evangelos Spiris. Luis D. Mora Mejia. Adrian C. Aguada. Giorgi Nicolau. Akash Lila Romani. Ryan J. Thomas. Ayokunle Peter Oluboyo. Shatish Kandari. Nasherban M. Tirmizi. Kai Kramer. Avi Batnagar. Anupreet Palkar. Mohammad Usman. Nathaniel Hardy Housefather. Syed Aman K. Shah. Christopher Esquivel. Alexis Alfredo Escutia. Saul Antonio Avila. Justin June Ho. Allison Jessica Tagulao Banaya. Alia Zaveta Andreyushenko. Cody A. Autry. Muhammad Bilal Khan. Matt Lauterbach. Robert P. Petrov. Ravel S. Valdez. Robert Jerome Brunyarczyk II. Beza Noor Soilu. Luke Cho Kim. Lucas Lee Beasley. Powell Garrido McCarthy. Paul Kuriakos Chiramel. Timothy Patrick O'Loughlin. Damon Sang. Yusuf Shuaibi. Kshistov S. Sendetsky. And Mo Vijay Bhatia. Mohammed Hisham Moizuddin. Anura Gredi Yerobotula. J. Shri Ram Goka. Sai Varsit Reddy Kurungunkla. 
Sai Rahul Raju Kakarlapudi. Alfredo D. Palacios. Omar Carrillo. Ahmed Ben Shahida. Aditya G. Nadkarni. Mohammed S. Hassan. Raghav Sharma. Burhanadeen Katleriwala. Huzaifa Javid. Raul Sher. Samuel James. Ivan Macias. Reza Hussein. Paul Yusuf. Niraj Kishore Salunke. Michael Demeter Mihaiwov. Shei Hao Chang. Ke Li. Shu Dong Zhang. Chloe Seaman Lee. Suhail Alo. Yash Mukul Varma. Kartik Maheshwari. Sylvia Joseph. Alvin G. Joseph. Pranav Sundar Singh Rathod. Angel Cardenas. Shu Dan Zhang. Ian Zachary Garcia Ubaldo. Zachary R. Tepper. Justin Stanley. Jesus Curio. Omar Mosab Al Musadi. Samuel J. Guardalabene. Pranay Singh. Jonathan J. Perthel. Alexander Emil Domagala. Saba Nemsadze. Elijah L. Guptill. Sayeda Afifa Nadim. Himangi Gupta. Chanel Leona DeJello Pasha. Eli Nathaniel Eckhouse. Mira R. Swice. Milena Miushkovic. Adriana Olvera Cabral. Mikhail Maris. Siddhant Satyan. Moises F. Ochoa. Christopher D. Simak. Raudel Rodriguez. Alejandro Perez. Siddharth Chatra. Tom Nguyen. Omar Amr. Victor Hernandez. Sachet Ranjan Vesi. Hardik Gold. Sibirut Delhi Suan. Hawea Mohammed Ahmed Elmi. 
Eric Calixto Castanon. Nathan A. Vela. Darlene Gray Salaxican. Razi Gowry. Jay Rami. Cayenne Cartoon. Wilfredo A. Najera. Ikram A. Khan. Michael Rodney Snater. Danielle Alfonso Cruz. Mujtaba H. Irfan. Mizbah Mohammed. Sanjay Powdell. Quay Tran. An Bui. Andres Cuevas. Joseph Glass. Jordan Cedric Siewe Chokoka. Valentina Fong. Tian A. Dow. Giovanni Jacob. Andres Perez. Francis Dawood. Enrique Tinoco Sosa. Basit A. Syed. Raul Costilla. Rajiv Subramanian. Rudolph J. Webster. Uchechi Joyce Obona. David J. Castillo. Jenny V. Ike. Jose E. Cruz Barriera. Juan Rodolfo Garcia. Selena Torres. Daniel Gonzalez. Christy Bowie. Fortino Chavez. Cho Tan Tyke. Kayla Vargas. Alan Balthazar Anaya. Arman Rashid. Isaac Hurd. Joseph Henry Ackle. Andres Dimas Jr. Oscar Montelongo. Enrique Quiroz. Ezaz Udin. Yakub A. Awainrin. Amin C. Mbia. Alejandro Chavez. Vagish Narayan Manohar. Jeffin J. Calapurreo. Rafael Rivas. Winston T. Rowe. Eric Rivera. Jose Daniel Alvarez. Anthony Navarrete. Ryan M. Chismar. Kyle J. Davis. Lucas Peyton Bryan. Vicious Patel. Murad Mala. Mohammed S. Afzo. Rafael Esparza Jr. Ali S. Raza. Ryan Louis. Bijou P. John. 
Mohammed Zaim Urrehman Siddiqui. Madeline C. Patiak. Jose Augustine Medrano Jr. Hugo Phil Ocampo. Zachary Hans Chua. Carl Daniel Kalau Archangel. Anna Marie Elizabeth Darvold. Angel Mary Thomas. Alexander O. Davies. Thank you so Rodna much. Rodna Chakravarti. Deep Manoj Kumar Shah. Sahil Modgil. Jay Woon Jun. Ho Chiao Sang. Cindy Yin Zhu. Ibrahim S. Isfahani. Steve Olivier Moliere. Maya Anna Vilchinska. Angad S. Burke. Anuj Ketan Kumar Soni. Shriman Rao Pallati. David Monares. Luis Gustavo Hernandez. Edwin Osorio. Eric Prashibashevsky. Lopa A. Patel. Mohammed Adnan Yarif Bai Bahora. Daniel Cole Rasmussen. Samuel Thelonious Jordan. Adam John Hami Duyale. Conrad Materna. Mevin T. George. Keshu Akul Kashio. Krish Nilesh Patel. Mehu Agarwal. Petrus A. Nikos. Stevenson Durning. Swadrisnia Rosier. Liam N. Doherty. Giovanni P. Vielli. Luis Alberto Franco. Alexis Flores. Umer S. Chowdhury. Martin Youssef. Tejas James. Juan E. Cruz. Long T. Vaughn. Hannah L. Thiel. Philip Savio Vadakara. Daniel Ochoa. Ethan Ryan Morical. Dia Patel. Jacqueline Camarena Saavedra. Omar Arez Chagoya. Alejandro Gonzalez. Sean Francis Burns. Bashir J. L. Zacco. Abdul Kabir H. Yaya. Carl Ivan Reiner S. Calarde. Andres Aviles. 
Martin M. Quiroz, Jr. Frederick Alonzo Davis, Jr. Jeffrey A. Weedoff. Joseph Wiseman. Liana Jacob Chicorio. Jaime Huichapa. Adam Gorski. Jacob Tolwinski. Saud Z. Jarada. Alexander S. Damien. Matthew Murius. Henry Fong Pham. Matthew J. Mihalik. Rashid Mohammed Ibrahim Ahmed Almarzuki. Ahmed Islam. Kevin K. Georgia. Alvin Lee. Anushka Sen. Fernando Joel Estrada Vallejo. Alia Hayel Akrushada. Augie Luindua Jamtis. Kyle James Nisiak. Anon Ayer Ammon. Yulia Zelineva. Dane Rouncevill. Masroor Tafader. Hina Collins. Chuo Bin Chue. Martin Escobar, Jr. Juan Serna. Jonathan Ruiz. Rishik Shripati Panditurajula. Andrew Dye. Raman Irampool. Ricardo Torres. Pramesh Balwani Mirchandani. Vijdan Ahmed Hanfi. Harry Chuhunanso Obikili. Siddharth Ramesh Reddy. Anirud Jairam. Tamansorn Jusiriko. Mansi Dipakbai Patel. Zoha Mahmoud. Carmen Mirza. Siham Mostafa Mossad Sheldun. Sergio Galindo. Shane Michael Plesha. Sebastian Carell. Gabriel Barba. Adam D. Scheid. John Marquette Hahn. Alexander David Powers. Simon J. Marinelli. Michael Jan Guza. Giselle Villalobos de Santiago. Lauren Bianca Garner. Jonathan Andrew Bashorka. Giovanni Gonzalez. Kaiser Miramontes. Fabricio J. Gomez. Hannah Day Waller. 
Anna Carantiani. Antonio Dino Salerno. Fabian Fonseca. Brandon John Arias. Joseph Rudzinski. Joseph W. Leotine. James Mastelers. Jose Rodriguez. George D. Markopoulos. Alejandra Velasquez. Matthew D. Atchison. Abigail M. Halinga. Adam G. Camarena. David John Marie Halber. Christopher J. Kaloje. Juby Omen. Safi Al Harani. Anand Pudi. Jorge Blanco. I would like to take this opportunity to thank the UIC staff members whose efforts made today's celebration possible. UIC staff members contribute in so many ways to the function of our enormous and complex institution, and we owe them our gratitude and for their excellence. To our most recent graduates of the UIC College of Engineering, congratulations on your momentous achievement. As you embark on the next chapter of your lives, remember that success is not only about professional accomplishments, but also about enjoying what you do and making a difference in the world. As engineers, you have the power to make a difference in the world, but don't forget to also make a difference in the lives of those closest to you. I wish you all the best in your future endeavors, and may you find joy and fulfillment in both your personal and professional lives. Congratulations again. At the conclusion of today's ceremony, the audience and graduates are asked to remain seated until the platform party and faculty have recessed. Please exercise caution when leaving the arena and parking areas. In conclusion, congratulations to our graduates and to all the family and friends on this memorable day. The spring 2023 commencement ceremony is now adjourned. Banner carriers, please come forward and escort the platform party and faculty.